buildings that once once had a purpose and have now been completely vacated. They 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 now have no role in 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 the economy in the community anymore, and they've just been left to ruin. And you see them. You can, there are many in the countryside, in towns, villages, and also many in Aberdeen, even in the middle of the city. I think one of my favourite examples of that is uh, the Broadford Works in Aberdeen, which is almost bang in the centre of Charlotte Street. And it closed down in 2002. It was a the name of the factory was Richards and they used to make hoses and other bits and pieces and one day the workers just didn't see their pay come into their bank accounts and that was that and they were told to go home Jeez, oh. and it closed, closed forever. It's empty and cavernous and Pretty chilling. Pretty impressive. Yeah, Glenady's Glenady was pretty special. Glenady is a gigantic hosp old hospital uh, on the hill, on a hill up above Bankery. And I think it started out as a as maybe uh, it's, it's, it's been a sanatorium and a hotel and a rehabilitation centre for for troops back in the Second World War. And it was a gigantic wooden, wooden, very intricate building. Yeah, so you could go inside and you could find the patient's papers, you could see wheelchairs and beds. And the old library was pretty cool. The old library and records and a gramophone and just maybe get yourself a little inkling about what, what life would have been like in that place all those years ago. There's an enormous amount of beauty to be found in decay and it's everywhere. The difference between being a kid and being an adult is uh, you have a much different perspective. As a child, you, you go there out of inquisitiveness, out of danger, and you do, it, you do it as an adult as well, but the thing that's different is that you're able to reflect more on, on how the place used to be and the reasons it got like that, and why all these incredible buildings have been completely abandoned due to lack of money and council budget cuts and industries moving elsewhere, moving overseas and it's, it feels more profound to go in as an adult and to, to go in and reflect on why these incredible places are being laid to ruin. Yeah. Why, 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 why do you, why do you two do it? Live in Aberdeenshire, there's little else to do. <laughs> <laughs>